Hi friends, this is Miss Karen. Today I'm going to read Monsters Don't Eat Broccoli. This book is written by Barbara Jean Hicks and the illustrations are by Sue Hendra. Now I'm going to need your help in this book for part of the story. There's going to be a space where we're going to say together, Fum, Fo, Fi, Fi, Monsters Don't Eat Broccoli. And we're going to repeat that three times. Each time we're going to get a little bit louder. Okay? So let's practice that one more time. Fum, fo, fi, fi. Monsters don't eat broccoli. Okay? Thank you. Now let's start at the beginning of our story. Monsters don't eat broccoli. The waitress in this restaurant just doesn't have a clue. Monsters don't eat broccoli. How could she think we do? We'd rather snap on tractors. Hmm. Or a rocket ship or two. or tender trailer tidbits. Or a wheelie steely stew. Fum, fo, fi, fi. Monsters don't eat broccoli. Fum, fo, fi, fi. Monsters don't eat broccoli. Fum, fo, fi, fi, monsters don't eat broccoli. Monsters don't eat broccoli or artichokes or greens. We can't abide alfalfa sprouts or slimy lima beans. But redwoods are delectable. And boulders, what a treat. And a fountain so refreshing in this dreadful summer heat. Fum, fo, fi, fi, monsters don't eat broccoli. Fum, fo, fi, fi, monsters don't eat broccoli. Fum, fo, fi, fi, monsters don't eat broccoli. We're crazy for construction. And we crave our fish and ships. But monsters don't eat broccoli. It will not pass our lips. You cannot force us monsters to eat vegetables we hate. Let humans have the garden. We will eat the garden gate. Monsters don't eat broccoli. Monsters love a picnic on a blanket in the park with a clump of giant maples and their yummy, gummy bark. Fum, fo, fi, fi, you're chowing down on broccoli. <gasps> Say what? This isn't broccoli. It's crunchy, munchy tweez. And wow, are they delicious. Another helping, please. The end. Thanks so much for all your help with reading the story, friends. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day.